today I'm going to be talking to you guys about the difference between the current model year Superjet, which is the 08 through 2018, and the Kawasaki SXR 1500. And I'm going to be showing you the basic differences, a little bit of riding differences, and uh, just a few, I guess, comments on the differences between the holes and the similarities, so you guys can figure out which one you actually want to buy. I'm Chicks with Tricks. Welcome to my channel and join me as I video everything that I am passionate about. From reptiles to jet skis, drifting, and basically anything in between. Okay, so you're interested in buying a current model year ski. So you've got the Kawasaki SXR 1500 four stroke and you've got the Yamaha Superjet. And this is a two stroke, this is a four stroke. And the first thing you can tell is the size difference. The two stroke Yamaha Superjet is much smaller than the four stroke Kawasaki SXR 1500. Also, this is a 701 two stroke motor. That is a 1500 cc four stroke motor. This one needs premix, which means you have to put oil in the gas and you can't just go fill up straight from a pump. That one you can, so you can roll up to the pump, fill it up on the trailer and go. It also does need its oil changed, so that's a huge difference. Uh, whereas this has its oil in the fuel, that one does have to have an oil change uh, with oil and an oil filter just like your car. <laughs> Very different bikes, very different weights, very different 
larger tray. Come on, be nice. So there you go, line that up there. Take a look, see at that. Here we have the SXR 1500, the 2017. The biggest thing, or biggest difference outside of the size and the power is that you sit up a lot higher on one of these skis. The hole is higher out of the water, so your foot level when you're at speed is actually above where it would be on a super jet. So the tippiness is a little more pronounced, I've found. Very, very smooth power out of a four stroke. The four strokes just have It's a little bit harder. So if you want to go 
fast with a little bit of playfulness, great, 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 great speed. Oh, I'm all the way on the back of the tray and it's floating. Full idle. I cannot get the nose to pick up. I weigh 140 pounds. Yep. Full idle and it's just cruising. Much more buoyant than the super jet. But like I said, that's both easier and harder. You don't have as much balance, but there's more ski to wrestle with. So let's get a little a lap in here. And like I said, I have a lot less time on one of these than a super jet. So if my riding looks crappy, it's probably because it is.